What is up? What is going on, YouTube? So I'm in the uh, coop today, the Civic Coop, and me and my little cousin, well, tonight, me and my little cousin are gonna make a delivery. We are dropping the Acura off at Mayhem to get test fitted for a rear crash bar. Now, if some of you guys don't know, I'm gonna pull up his page on Instagram. Okay, so this is Mayhem Metal Works. Wow. Now, if some of you guys don't know, I'll put a link in the bio. He does crash bars for Hondas, Acuras. Now, fun fact, my car, my old car before it got stolen, was his prototype test fitter for the ITR J front OEM bumper. And it's funny because he, made a crash bar for the bumper that I have on now doesn't fit the OEM bumper. So he used my car to make the OEM bumper crash bar prototype situation using my other car. Now he has various, look at that, look at that, look at that. Uh, that's an EK front end. Rear crash bars for EGs, I do believe. Yeah, EG front and rears. <laughs> the man the man does amazing work. Uh, he's also doing battery ties. That's the ITR front. I use my car for a prototype for this bar right here. Let's see who else he has. Okay, so there's the battery. So, much love. He used my car and my photo as his homepage for his website. Much love to him for that. He's gonna use my car to make a prototype for a rear crash bar for the Integra, rear fog light friendly. Cause uh, if some of you guys don't know, the rear fog light on the USDM rear, you have to uh, cut into the crash bar, which is annoying. So he's gonna fit it and make it friendly for that. So we're gonna head to Mesa, me and my little cousin, uh, who's actually driving the Acura, I'm driving the coupe. He's driving the Acura and we're gonna head to Mesa and uh, catch up with him and see what he has for us. So fun fact, uh, CJ is actually my real cousin. Not, you know, my cousin cousin, but CJ's actually my real cousin. Um, he actually went with me to uh, California to go pick up the uh, the Acura, and I mean, he got some projects we gonna work on, but you know, he, don't trip, he got something. He's really known for his uh, rusted Accord and his Waggle van, but I never got to see them because he traded them off, so. Um, he's actually driving the Acura right now, getting the feel for the right-hand drive life, and he loves it because he has my speakers on, connected to my Bluetooth, like he owned the car, so. Well, I'll tell you one thing, you really, you can never really appreciate your car until somebody else drives it. Like, literally, watching him drive it makes me appreciate it so much more. So much more that I see it rolling, in my eyes, like, so, say if I see if I seen him driving, and I was like, yo, he's a shit. Like, now I get to appreciate my car a little bit more, now that I see it from a, a spectator's point of view, and I got it. I'm gonna get some rollers for y'all right now, so y'all can kind of appreciate it too. Bravo. <laughs> Whoever put that together, bravo. Unfortunately, I gotta take this opportunity and take a couple of pictures. Um, while I'm out here, I might as well get some rollers of the coupe. So what we're gonna do is switch cars right now. He's not gonna be happy. Go back some more. He's not gonna be happy, but we're switching cars now. I'm gonna take a couple of pictures real quick and then we're gonna get back on the road because it's kind of late. Uh, and people gotta go to work in the morning, so. Come here, come say hi to the, uh, uh, <laughs> the YouTube world. This is my little cousin, CJ. Hey. Uh, real cousin, like I said before. 
That's all he has to say is hey. <laughs> like I said before, he did go with me to get the Acura. He's been, you know. And the he, wheels. And the wheels. He did go with me to get yeah, me the wheels. I, yeah, I bust yeah. moves. I bust moves. He, he, he's, I bust the moves. He's active in the streets. You man. heard? Uh -uh. Yes. You heard? And he's my right-hand man yeah. when it comes to moving the Acura. Little does he know, he's about to drive the coupe now. Oh, uh, that's cool. Okay, cool. So, <laughs> so I can get rollers of the coupe. Because, um, man, uh, I'm falling in love with this coupe more and more. So take a couple pictures. I'm going to post on my Instagram. You already know SOB Steve's. Um, hopefully these pictures come out right. And they don't look like garbage. Okay, so we finally made it. It's a thunderstorm. Never trust, oh, there it is. Yeah, never trust the weather, man, during monsoon season in Phoenix. Never. But we're here, we made it. Car's tucked away in the garage, which looks fantastic in here. This is the man. It's um, me. It's me. <laughs> good intro, good intro. So what are we doing, basically, to this one? Uh, basically, what we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be installing one of our front bumper bars that we offer for the JDM front, but I'm also gonna be prototyping rears. Rears? Not only for uh, the JDM uh, rear bumper with this bad boy, but also just the Integra in general. Like I said, uh, this fog light right here, you have to cut the rear support. So the bumper bar that he's making is gonna be friendly, universal, so if you have this rear fog light in the right spot, it will be accessible for you so you don't have to cut it and it should bolt up mount up work perfect right yeah well i mean just like our i'm trying to make it very similar to the front jm that we make and it's basically direct bolt on no modifications needed and uh works with your factory headlight support brackets and everything you don't want to put the money in here <laughs> Damani, what is that? Just the EK? EK bumper? Yeah, it should work. Like I was saying, uh, the J front bar, we use my car. So we're here to get the rear one, and he's going to use that as a prototype, get that cracking. Basically, use mine as a, to make a jig, and then he's going to crank them out so it's available to the public. Yeah. And then you guys could buy it in whenever he gets the prototype, whatever. Finish. Yeah. That lightning is crazy. <laughs> I mean, as of right now, we offer them front rear EK, front rear EG, front roll Del Sol, and then obviously we'll be offering for the DC Integra chassis as well. All available in his link, which is going to be below in the bio. <laughs> and that's going to give you a direct link to his website, also his Instagram. Yep. Straight to the Instagram. And as you guys can see, so he's gonna have my car for a while so he can make some cool things like a 240 so my car can look even more like a <laughs> Sylvia or 240-ish, whatever it wants to look like. Cause it does look like a 240. Yeah, a little bit. Uh, so remember how you did the, uh, the bumper for the J-Front but it was for Ahmed's car? And it was actually for this bumper? It's actually not. Yeah, thanks, Ahmed. <laughs> now I have the same bumper as you, so I can have your bar too. As you guys know, the old bumper, which was on the old car, got stolen. So the very first prototype of the crash bar is no longer with us. So no sad. No idea where it is. No idea. So if it had a serial number, it'd be like 0001 and then a pretty signature, <laughs> but yeah, that one's long gone. So we're gonna get another one, throw it on the front. Somewhere above that light bar. Hey, that light bar is crazy. Yeah, yeah it, it's pretty annoying <laughs> on my own car. So, but I will have the prototype 001 back one. I'm gonna have the rear back one prototype. It's gonna be jazzy. Not too aggressive, but 
it adds like its own like touch to the car. You know the Key West. Right. Knowing the Key West is like the vintage, like 2000, the best. Everybody wanted the Key West kit. On yeah, the but you don't have huge fog light holes like right here, right there. <laughs> well, we just got a big ass light bar. Yeah, yeah we got a. <laughs> We That's don't need we don't need fog lights no more. In the 2000, the big thing was to put big fog lights, like we were doing a rally cross yep. in these bumpers. But now we just stick light bars in them. That's the 2018 instead of the 2000 ish. Raw with the clear coat. Sure, that's what you wanted to do. Yes. Different than the last time. Or no, no, no. No, we it's did the same clear. as last we time. We did yeah. okay. That's right. Or should I do this? I don't know, man. I do the raw with the clear. Okay, so raw with the clear? Raw with the clear. This should be up before I get my car back and before this is done. Mm -hmm. So comment below if I should get raw with the clear coat or what is this, flat black? Texture black. Texture black. Hold on, weld porn. Focus. Mm -hmm. There it is. Nope, not focus. Porn. Anyways, comment below if I should get this one and this one, or or this one, or front and back, or back and front. This is the one I had last time. If I should switch it, who knows? Okay, so comment below. Which one do you think I should get? Raw with the clear. <sighs> I would do raw with the clear. Mind, but, uh, yeah. What about you? I don't know, man. Obviously, I like the raw with the clear because yeah. it shows the type of work that I put into it, but. That's what I said last time, I don't which know, is man, fantastic. There's something about this being all black and then the freaking tag just pops. Comment below which one I should get. I love that car. I miss that car. I actually want to do. I actually thought about rushing my Demani. I ain't oh, gonna lie to you. You rushed your Demani? I'm gonna disown you. <laughs> <and my family. laughs> you rushed the Demani, it's over. No more cousins, no presents. But, but, but then I thought how good the cream would look, you know, but never mind. You doing cream on the Demani? I don't think you should do cream on the Demani. I was going to be purple bag. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to Broke Boys. Yeah, he killed that. You're done. Yeah, exactly. You're done. The demonic no game is no warm. warm. So I got to do something else now. Yeah, you better come hard. That's what I'm saying. You better do something crazy. You better drive upside down because he... And he on the floor with the SSRs. Yeah, shout out to Shane. He's the man. Pretty much wrapped everything up. Uh, actually beat the storm. I know you guys can't see it, but it was a thunderstorm for like all of 15 minutes. Bad, like thunder, scared everybody. Quaking in our boots. Hey, stop touching stuff. Thank you. <laughs> so we're Let's wrapping up with, with, with the man himself. Uh, we got everything squared away. What we're gonna do, we discussed how this came about. Caught up on a, a little thing. Hey, yo, you was at Ibach? You at Ibach this year? Yeah. Yeah, had a booth. Yeah, first year. How'd you had like it? Last, dude. I want to go back. Next year, you're going to be there? For sure, dude. Okay, good. So if you guys need stuff, save up now, and he's going to be there next year. Save your tax returns. So me and this guy are going to head back to the west side, which is like an hour an hour, minutes. An hour away. We're taking the EK Coupe, which is looking very nice. I got rollers of that. He can't drive and do rollers at the same time. So if they come out, in the same spot, that's because you wanted to say the same speed as me. <laughs> yeah, when I told you to slow down, you didn't slow down, you sped up. That's how you, that's how you told me to slow down, I kind of just stayed there. You were like... Dude, I can hear the intake on this thing every time you hit the gas. Is that that? That's what that little whining noise is. Really? Yes, it's terrible, I hate it. Because <laughs> you can hear it inside, too. Yeah, like your yeah. whistle. That's how I was like, uh, is supposed to do that? Yeah, Integers are known for having a little whistle on their intake manifolds. Hey, man, hey, speak for yourself, brother. My piece is over there, my, my body. my intake does that. Wait, yours isn't an Integra. Technically. Technically, it's not an Integra. The title said Integra. It's an Acura. Yeah. It's not an Acura Integra. Anyways, look, long story short, Integras, they have this little whistle thing on the stock manifolds. Sometimes, that's annoying. So, the Acura is going to be in the hands of this master fabricator, welder, designer. God. God. <laughs> well, well porn aficionado for a week or so. So, any videos are going to be of the coupe 
getting yeah. the work done on the crew. Yeah. What? Okay, you see? He does roll cables. Hey, over here. Bro. On his on his website, he says roll cables. I need what? Turbo manifolds. Yeah. Turbo so manifolds. Anything and everything. Anything and everything. You heard the man. I can roll cables first. Yeah, you're not getting a roll cables. You need to get running first. Yeah, man. So what's up with that? Money got to get running. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah. That's all the time we have for this episode. <laughs> <laughs> this is all the time we have for this episode. So tune back in next week and find out if uh, CJ ever gets his <laughs> <some quality. laughs> and we ever make it to that. Uh, uh, so maybe the next episode we try to troubleshoot this man's car. Where's he at? This man's car. Because it doesn't run. And if somebody wants to come over and help, that'd be appreciated. Because it's heat warnings all week. For the rest of the week. Extreme heat temperature warnings. I'm not digging it. Uh, he still wants me to help. But he's my cousin, so he helped me, I helped him. And I want to thank this guy for using my car once again. Thanks for bringing the car over. No problem. That's what I'm here for, to use this as samples for stuff that's not going to be seen. Why are you spinning around in the chair? Because it's a spinning chair. Who doesn't spin around in the chair? <laughs> true words, true words. So we're going to end this vlog here. Um, my cousin CJ, what is it? Where is your Instagram? Cruise to love at the money life. Cruise that. Cruise to love. Cruise to that love. the money life. That the money life. Yes, That's sir. a lot. <laughs> That's I'm not putting. I'm not putting that. Okay, you know me, SOB Steve's, and all this man's it. information will be will be in the description or all that jazz down below the that stuff. Yeah, all of his information is going to be there. Instagram, his website, all the good jazz. We gone. You recorded. Hold it by the neck. Hold it by the neck. Hold it by the neck. I hope y'all can hear this nonsense that's going on next to us. This is a Mustang that's trying to race us. It's an automatic V6. Come on, get over, man. Boy, you gone. <laughs> you gone, boy. That's trash. What's going on here? Look. Every time I catch up.